audio tip test 7 the missing child you will hear an audio script concerning a mission related topic this script will be followed by a conversation between two persons this conversation will relate to the script you will hear the tape only once you will make notes of the script and of the conversation from this note you will be instructed either to answer 10 questions or complete a written report of the incident. Good luck. On 4th October 2005, UN Police Operations Coordinator was on routine visit of all the Liberian National Police Stations located in Monrovia City. With him, where UN ID number Charlie Papa 254 at station number 2 they met the chief of police who gave his name as John he told the team that he has been in charge of this station since the war ended in year 2003 and that since then there has never been any serious incident like the one that occurred on the last day in the month of September 2005 in which a boy of six years drowned in the lagoon. The boy is the only child of his 32 years old mother whose husband died during the war in 1999. She is a fish seller in the fish market located 65 meters from the Atlantic Ocean. She and her son live in the blue house beside the police station. The mother usually works in the marketplace and the boy normally goes to school. On that fateful day, however, all the schools were closed due to a holiday. There was no one at home that the boy could stay with. So the boy went to the marketplace with his mother at 0800 hours. While the mother was busy with customers, he left without telling her and headed to the beach. He has been in the habit of going to play on the beach each time he goes with his mother to the marketplace. His mother has always been too busy with her business to notice this. As usual, she again did not know when her son left for the beach until about an hour later when she realized that the boy did not take breakfast and that she brought some food from home. The boy could not be seen anywhere around the market. She searched everywhere but could not find him. Her friend advised her to report to the police. She did as her friend had advised and the police together with all the market women started searching for the boy all over the neighborhood. But he could still not be found. The search went on until 1400 hours on 3rd October 2005 when a fisherman who was walking on the beach found the body of a young male person on the seaside al alerted the police because he was aware that a child had been declared missing by the police three days earlier. The boy's mother, who came along with the police immediately, identified the body to be that of her missing son. She recognized the black spot on the bridge of his nose which he had from birth. She also recognized the brown shorts and black sweater as well as a small gold ring on his left forefinger. The body was taken to the general hospital where it was confirmed after examination that the boy died of drowning. The police chief told the coordinator that a number of people drown every year in the ocean. But this has always been in other parts of Monrovia and not in his area. 
He was so upset that such a tra tragedy has now occurred in his area of responsibility. The following conversation was between the UN Police Operations Coordinator and the boy's mother. Good morning. I was told you are the mother of the boy that drowned in the ocean. Yes, I am his mother. He is my only child. His father died during the war in 1999. How old are you and what do you do for a living? I am 32 years old. I sell fish in the fish market. The market is about 65 meters away from the Atlantic Ocean. Where do you live? Our house is the blue house beside the police station. Why did you take your son to the fish market on the 30th September 2005? My son's school, like every other school in Liberia, is on holidays and there is no one to take care of him at home. That is why I took him with me to the market like I do every day. What happened while you were in the market? I was too busy attending to my customers and did not know when he left. It was about an hour later that I discovered he was not around. Did you know that he has been going to play on the beach each time he goes to the market? I have always been too busy to notice what he does or where he goes to. What did you do when you discovered that your son was not around to take his meal? I searched around the market but could not find him. Upon my friend's advice, I went to police station number two and reported to the officer on duty. Where was he found and who found him? I will say that my son was never found because only his dead body was found by a fisherman lying by the seaside and a dead body is as bad as if he was not found. How did you know that the found dead body was that of your son? My son had a black spot on the bridge of his nose right from birth. I could not make any mistake about that. I also recognized the clothes he was putting on, as well as a small gold ring he had on his left forefinger. Do you suspect any foul play? I can't doubt the expert who found out that my son died of drowning. I guess I haven't been a good mother. I paid more attention on my business than on my only son. I am sorry. Accept my sympathy. Thank you.